Okay, uh, first, I'm, I'm gonna be making lead pick right today. Here's my pick acid and my uh, uh, lead oxide. I already weighed everything out. So today I have uh, four grams of pick acid and two, gram, two grams of uh, lead oxide. And we're going to dissolve it in methanol. And yeah, so let's get started. Okay. That stir bar is way too big for that. Nah, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this to dissolve everything. And then we will we'll add in the lead oxide and it will precipitate the salt lead pig rain. Start heating as well. There we go. I'll, I'll be adding in the uh, lead oxide. This reaction is um, picric acid with lead oxide in a two to one stoichiometry. Whoops. Uh, Hand and shot. Should be working fine. Pin stand down a little bit. There we go. So, just gonna wait for this to boil down and then we will have our uh, lead pick rate. All right, so the lead pick rate went straight through my filter, and uh, so I'm just gonna have to evaporate this down so I can uh, get it out. Yeah, it's a little bit longer, and then uh, and then I'll just let it evaporate uh, no normally, and then, then I'll uh, scrape the uh, solid off the bottom. <clears throat> I should not have done that. Uh, it's definitely, um, yeah. This stuff stains fucking everything, by the way. L look at the joint. That went through the joint and stained it. Not, not even... It angers me. I'm gonna have to spend so much fucking time cleaning. Alright, today we'll, uh, we're making, um, making lead pick, right? And some over here. Uh, from lead nitrate and uh, yeah, from lead nitrate and picric acid. Um, I already did the preparation with the lead oxide, so I'm gonna make some uh, lead nitrate here with nitric acid and uh, lead oxide. Should react. And yeah, let that go. All right, so we're gonna get this to um, near the boiling point of the acid, so uh, all this reacts. You can see, it's already reacting, becoming a becoming a lead nitrate. But you know, it's not all. Right, to speed up the reaction rate, we're gonna heat it up. I have my stir plate on, uh, the heating already. Just, yeah, I'm driving off the last of the nitric acid in the uh, in the. Uh, uh, lead nitrate solution with a uh, double boiler. Put this uh, jar with the uh, solution inside of it, inside of a beaker with uh, water. I'm boiling the water to uh, heat up the solution, but below its boiling point so that uh, the acid comes off uh, without boiling so it doesn't splash everywhere. Okay. So, I've got a tripod. I'm gonna be using that for the next half of this video. All right, so. Uh, we're going to be making lead pick rate through um, through the uh, the lead nitrate uh, method, lead nitrate lye method. Here is um, our picric acid, two grams. Here's a solution of the sodium hydroxide. Get a shot. Yeah, 0.35 grams in there. I'm just going to add water in here and start stirring. Now I'm gonna add the sodium hydroxide solution. Should get a color change. Yeah, cool. 
we'll wait for that to fully react and uh, then we'll get back to you. All right, now that that has fully reacted, I'm gonna add the lead nitrate uh, in a water solution. We should get a precipitate. Yeah, there we go. Wonderful. I'm gonna wash this out and uh, try to get all the lead nitrate in there. So I'm gonna let that stir for a little bit, then I'll um, I'll probably have to boil this down because I know my filters are really shitty. While we while we let that uh, stir, uh, let that react, I'm gonna go over the chemistry. The uh, lime method, the method I, I just did, is the sodium hydroxide uh, with the picric acid into uh, sodium picrate and uh, water, and then you react that with lead nitrate, sodium picrate, and it becomes a uh, you know, PBCC6H2O7-2, uh, and uh, sodium nitrate. And here's the reaction series down here, uh, drawn out fully. This has to be done in an aqueous solution, as far as I know. I haven't tried it in methanol, but uh, I, I will eventually. That's the, uh, yeah, the uh, sodium nitrate. Uh, which is going to be impurity for this, and that's why I like uh, the lead oxide method better because it because it only produces um, water as an impurity. So the lead oxide method I'd say is easier. Uh, I think you get more yield with the lye method, but I don't know. Uh, the lead oxide method is just standard lead oxide and the two picric acids reacting to create lead picrate and water in a methanol solution. Um, yeah, it, it's real easy. It's pretty great. Now, the other side. This is our first primary explosive for the channel, which is pretty great. Uh, lead pick rate, the explosive yield is about 45% of picric acid. Uh, it does melt before it explodes. The fire diamond is a, uh, if I remember correctly, four inflammability, three in hell and four in reactivity and it's an explosive it's a lead salt so it's poisonous and can be absorbed through the skin as far as i know it's not a carcinogen its melting point is 121.8 degrees its uh detonation point is 300 degrees uh it, you know it, it's a it's a pretty good explosive it's pretty good i like it i recommend uh if you, if you were to do this yourself um, if you are to do this yourself, I recommend the, uh, lead oxide method because it's generally easier to do, uh, unless you completely fuck up and have to buy your own lead oxide. Alright, these are the filters that I was talking about. They're decent. I mean, once I get proper filter paper, I will not be using them whatsoever. But, um, you know, just, it worked. Oops. Uh, yeah. So let's uh, try and filter our, our solution. Hopefully, it doesn't go straight through the uh, filter. And yeah. Hold on. Wait for that to filter. 